and gentlemen, I am Christy McGarry. And I am Andre Brulette. And welcome to Miss Universe Philippines 2020. This is the red carpet presentation. We are here currently with our venue partner, Manila Hotel. And guys, later, please tune in to Facebook Live, the Miss Universe PH. Okay, guys watching. Hello, everyone, all the netizens as well. And whether you're here watching our candidates or on Facebook Live, we will finally meet our phenomenal women who are eyeing the crown of the first ever Miss Universe Philippines beauty contest. More than just a brand and a pageant, Miss Universe Philippines is an organization that encourages women to become empowered individuals who embody the mission of being agents of meaningful change wherever they are. These women participate in program training to become role models pursuing personal and professional goals while leaving and inspiring a positive impact on this society. Now, after weeks of screening, we are now ready to reveal the list of our confident, beautiful, and empowered Filipinas. These women were selected for their utmost potential in embodying the three key pillars of the Miss Universe Philippines, which are beautiful transformations, beyond the coastlines, and inspiring women with action. Let's tell you a little bit more about these three pillars. Beautiful Transformations is the journey of contestant to achieving the best version of herself through training facilitated by some of the best in the, be in the business pageant, fashion, and styling, such as past beauty queens, experts, and Empire Studios. Our first roller coaster of candidates have both raw women with high potential and some veterans in the pageant scene, but all equally capable of being young leaders through this pageant. In the coming weeks, we will be releasing a season pass so as fans can see the girls' transformations all yourselves. Now, Beyond the Coastline trains the standout stunners to keep their feet on the ground and connect with their roots. This will open their eyes to all the best that the Philippines has to offer with our particular focus in sustainable tourism. Each contestant is expected to be ambassadors of the islands before, during, and after the competition. Also, we have Inspiring Women with Action. This trains and supports contestants with their own chosen advocacies, especially those that are sustainable and replicable in other places. This is what makes our Miss Universe Philippines. That's right, Andre. And since you're with us here today and excited to meet our candidates, Join in on the fun on social media. Share your favorite moments and take photos and post them with our official hashtags, Miss Universe Philippines, Phenomenal Woman, Beautiful Transformations, Beyond the Coastlines, Inspiring Women with Action, One Philippines and Team Philippines. Find us on the Miss Universe PH on Facebook and on Instagram. Are you all ready? Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet our Miss Universe Philippines 2020 candidates. The province of Aklan. 
South by. Buenos días a todo el mundo. Me llamo Paula Ortega. I am a MedLab technician and a nurse. Both titles taken in Barcelona, Spain. I am proudly representing Albay. Angela City. Antique. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Josel Marie Robenta, a registered nurse, and I am honored to represent the province of Antique. Aurora. Princess Marquez Laureano, Civil Registry Associate in Profession, proudly representing Province of Aurora. Baguio City.
Peraka Mine Eagle up front. A government employee at Clark Development Corporation representing the summer capital of the Philippines, Baguio City. Batanes. Sa tabu, si Chama Kuya Baya, Yakun si Jan Alexis Elcano, Machinanao sa turismo, a um representa su kabahayan nu Batanes. Batangas. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Natalia Ursha, taking tourism management, representing Batangas. Piliran. everyone. I am Skelly Ivy Florida, taking up tourism management from the beautiful province of Biliran. Bohol. Good afternoon. I am Pauline Cucharo Amlings, a retail and sales consultant, proudly representing the very beautiful island province of Bohol. Bulacan.
Cagayan de Oro. My name is Vinci Labadan Bacalares. I am a high school teacher and I am representing the City of Golden Friendship, Cagayan de Oro City. Cagayan Province. I'm Lara Ashraf Abdelhamid, an ambassador of goodwill from the beautiful province of Capiz. I am Sigrid Grace Flores, a missionary from the Happy Island, Ketanduanes, Capite.
kahapon, Billy Hackinson, flight attendant representing the historical capital of the Philippines, the province of Cavite. Cebu City. Maayong hapon ka natong tanan. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Tracy Maureen Perez, an industrial engineer, a model, and a host from the Queen City of the South, Cebu City. Province of Cebu. My name is April Smith, a dynamic athlete from the festive island of the province of Cebu. Davao City. I am Wam Ahmed, representing the beautiful highlands and islands of Davao del Norte. General Santos.
Magandang Jensen. I'm Marielle Joyce Pasqua, flight attendant, Gikan sa Ciudad sa General Santos. Isabella. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Maria Regina Malana, a licensed dentist representing Isabella. Ilocos Sur. Currently, I am working as a review center lecturer for both local and international board examinations. And I am proud to represent the city of love, my Iloilo city. Flight attendant from the province of Iloilo. Kalinga.
Presidential Staff Officer, Province of Caliga. Laguna. Marketing specialist and events host representing Makati City. Mandawe. Ako di ay si Lou Dominic Pixon, an account executive, Mandawi City, Cebu. Manila.
Good day, everyone. I'm Alexandra Abdon, Marketing and Creative Director from the City of Manila. Maranduque. I am Maria Lianina Macalino, a graduate of chemistry minor in business studies, and I am representing Marin Duque. Misamis Oriental. I am Caroline Joy Veronilia, a fundraiser for children representing Misamis Oriental. Muntin Lupa. Occidental. Angela Aninang, Registered Medical Technologist, pursuing Doctors in Medicine, Negros Occidental. Oriental Mendoro. Hitomi Ariate Akiyama, registered nurse and graduating student of Doctor of Medicine, representing Oriental Mindoro. Palawan.
Jennifer and Linda Tourism Operation from the last ecological frontier where the nature begins and never ends, Palawan. Pampanga. Aldo Puke Kayungan, Patricia Pineda Santos, Light Attendant, Pampanga! Pangasinan! I am Maria Nina Copuyok Soriano, a preschool teacher from Pangasinan. Paraniake. Development, and I'm proudly representing Paranaque City. Basai. Everyone, my name is Sandra Nicole Santa Maria, flight attendant from Pasay City. Pasig City.
Valentine's Day, everyone. My name is Michelle Teresa Imperial Gumabal. I'm a professional volleyball player, and I am representing Quezon City. Quezon Province. Magandang hapon sa inyo lahat. Ako po si Faye Dominic Babiera de Vesa, currently working with her family business, representing the home of festivals, Quezon Province! Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Erica Evangelista, a former business development manager turned fashion designer and CEO, proudly representing the capital, the art capital of the Philippines, Rizal Province. Romplon. Isabella Galeria, a registered nurse and a professional model from the province of Sorsogon. Surigao del Norte.
Marajao na hapon. I am Carissa Roselle Manasan Keza, education student representing province of Surigao del Norte. Taguig City. Gentlemen, our beautiful candidates for Miss Universe Philippines 2020. What do you think about the girls so far, Andre? I think they're absolutely stunning, representing this country greatly. Yes, and I love their beautiful modern Filipinas as well. Everyone is looking super gorgeous, and they all look ready for the crown. They truly represent what it means to be a confident, beautiful, and empowered Filipina. The music you heard tonight, or today, is actually an original composition by Kiko Salazar, especially made for Miss Universe Philippines. Now the journey of our phenomenal woman only begins now. They will train under the best experts of the industry to embody their beautiful transformations, go around the Philippines to empower beyond the coastlines, and will have the chance to support their respective advocacies by upholding and inspiring women with action. You can witness their entire meaningful journey online through the Miss Universe PH Facebook and Instagram. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome once again our first ever Miss Universe Philippines 2020 candidate.
of applause for our phenomenal women. Our first ever Miss Universe Philippine candidate. Miss Philippine Universe 2020 will not be possible without our event partners and sponsors. To honor them, I would like to invite on stage Miss Universe Philippines National Director, Miss Shamsi Supsupli. Valentine's Day to all of you. Once again, we want to thank all of you for all your support for the first ever Miss Universe Philippines 2020 and uh, follow our journey as we choose the phenomenal woman who will compete and who will represent our country in the Miss Universe pageant. The Miss Universe Philippines sponsors, our venue sponsor and partner, Manila Hotel. Special thanks to Michael Ruiz for set design and our Peggio sounds and lights. Applause. For Miss Universe Philippines Crow presenter, Front Row Philippines, I'd like to invite on stage none other than Front Row Philippines President, R.S. Francisco, and Chief Executive Officer, Sam Versoza. Filipinas Glow. Arthur Pena, head of PH Media Operations, and Jun San Juan, PNG, PNG Philippines Skin Care Communications Leader. are very excited to finally be part of Miss Universe Philippines. Uh, as you've seen, Pia has been our endorser, brand ambassador since 2015, and we're very excited to carry on the journey with Miss Universe Philippines. So to all the ladies, good luck, and actually congratulations. Downey, beauty that never fades. Arthur Pena, head of PH Media, PNG Philippines, and June San Juan, PNG Philippines, skin care communications leader. From PLDT Home, our PLDT executives, Sheila Palmino, John Van Medrano, Daphne Gripal, and Maris Naguera. Anytime Fitness. Marketing Officer Tony Carmona and Regional Director Mohammed Shah. Covenant car, Morris Garages. 
EVP and Marketing Director Lynn Buena, Brand Manager Rainer Ranin, and PR Manager Shino Subido, Events Manager Joey Abina. Uh, we look forward to the synergy between our two organizations and uh, we're very excited to be a part and uh, congratulations and good luck to all the girls. Thank you. From Boucher. COO Kay Danganan and Production Manager, Ran Danangan, Odessa Orsela Sales and Marketing Head. Havayanas. Hansel Gapai. From Vision Eyewear, we have Karen Gapwani. Thank you very much for having us. Um, we're the leading optical chain in the Philippines that carries all the Ray-Bans and all the eyewear in the Philippines. So hopefully you can come visit us soon and pick an eyewear for you. Thank you. From Cream Silk, Filipinas Conditioned for Greater. Apple Zabarin, head of PR of Unilever Philippines. to be here. We at Cream Silk have always empowered the Filipina to be at her ultimate. So this is the perfect partnership. And with the launch of our Conditioned for Greater campaign, we want to encourage Filipinas to never settle for good and to always strive to be greater. So we are thankful to be here and we are so excited for all of you. Congratulations girls, your journey has just begun. Thank you. May we invite on stage the leadership behind the first ever Miss Universe Philippines. May we please call up Mario Garcia, Head of Business Development. Albert Andrada, Design Council Head. Leah Ramos, Head of Women Empowerment and Charity. Attorney Nad Bronson, Head of Legal Affairs. Jonas Gafud, Creative Director. And Sam C. Sup -Sup Lee. National Director. We would also like to thank Grab Philippines. Buchay. Vision Eyewear. Cetaphil Sun. St. Luke's Medical Center. Daya Gold. Nick Studios. Daya Diva. Empire PH. Empire Studios. Game Manila. Center of Aesthetic Dentistry. Pedro and Koi. Jing Monas Salon. And Smiley. Now, a 
aside from meeting all our Miss Universe Philippines 2020 candidates today, we celebrate another special occasion, Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to our pillars, our dearest sponsors, our media and press, our candidates, and to all our guests. Go tell everyone out there who you love, how much you appreciate them, and take care of them. Thank you to our presenter, sponsors, media, press, guests, and everyone who joined us this afternoon. This is just the beginning of a phenomenal world with phenomenal women as they embark in their journey to the crown. There's a lot more to look forward to with these candidates. That's right, Andre, they will have photo shoots, video shoots, and activities that would focus on their advocacy, women empowerment, and island tours. They will train under only the best experts of the industry to embody their beautiful transformations, go around the Philippines to empower beyond the coastlines, and of course, will have the chance to support their respective advocacy to uphold inspiring women with action. This journey will accumulate in Fashion Week. There will be, they will be showcasing the best of the best in the Philippine artistry in fashion. Also in the preliminary competition where you will watch the girls strut the runway and show why they deserve to be the very first Miss Universe Philippines. And of course, we await our first ever Miss Universe Philippines during Coronation Night. Also our sponsor, Nick Sorian. Big thank you for supporting and sponsoring. Thank you, Nick Soriano, for being our supporting sponsor and making these girls look glamorous tonight. Again, ladies and gentlemen, you can witness this meaningful journey at the Miss Universe PH on Facebook and Instagram. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for the first ever Miss Universe Philippines 2020 candidates. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. This has been your Miss Universe Philippines red carpet host, Andre Brulette. And I'm Christy McGarry. Have, Have a, a great, great afternoon. afternoon.